Welcome to the March Luxury Market Report brought to you by MansionArizona.com. I'm your luxury real estate professional, Jeremy Pales, and in this episode, we're going to take a look at the luxury real estate market in Paradise Valley, Arizona. The Paradise Valley single family luxury market is now a buyer's market with a 13% sales ratio. Homes sold for median of 95.92% of the list price in February of 2023, up 2% from last month. The luxury benchmark price remains at $1.7 million. Total inventory was 165. Total sales were 22. The price band with the most sales was 3 to $3.5 million with six homes sold. The price band with the most inventory was 10 to $15 million with 23 homes available. The median sales price was $3.2 million down from $3.7 million last year, a 13% decrease. Total inventory is up 143% compared to last year, and that's substantial. Total sales were down 46%, and the days on market were 47 days compared to 46 last February. Though the median sales price for the Paradise Valley luxury housing market dropped $1 million from last month, it's falling in line with the trends of the last seven months, oscillating between three and $3.6 million. Last month seems to be an anomaly. All of this, and the shift back to a buyer's market indicates we're watching this particular market normalize. If you want to see if this trend continues and to see the awesome luxury home tours we have lined up, make sure you subscribe to the channel and select that bell icon so you're notified when a new video is released. Now for some insights on the greater luxury market from our partners at the Institute for Luxury Home Marketing. The demand for luxury real estate examined. Over the last two and a half years, the state of the luxury real estate market has become one of the hottest topics discussed in the news outlets, multimedia platforms, and within the industry itself. Conversations initially focused on spiraling demand and rising prices. This was soon followed by reports on the increasing demand for multifaceted relocations and migrations. After which, the impact of falling inventory levels took prime spot. While these topics are still highly key in understanding the current market, the declining sales volume has become the most recent focus of attention by the media. Reports of plunging sales have sparked much discussion as to what the spring market will bring. Coupled with the uncertainty about the economy and whether there will be any further changes to the interest rate. But there's also quiet optimism in the air. Overall prices seem little impacted. According to the Institute's median sold prices for the last three months, prices have edged up, and there's only a small 1.38% decrease compared to February of 2022. The reality is that except for markets where buying frenzy caused both price increases and continued sales growth to become unsustainable, luxury home purchases are mostly returning to more traditional transaction levels. The data from February 2023 does indicate there's positive movement with respect to sales. Compared to January 2023, the number of new listings entering the market increased. But of more significance is that the number of sales also increased in both single family and attached markets. This may only be the start of a possible trend, but if it continues in this direction, buyer demand, which has remained hesitant for the last few months, could return as we enter the spring market. While the affluent tend to be less impacted by outside influences, Concerns over the financial market and economic variables have seen buyers take a long pause. However, with less competition and more competitive rates for mortgage and other loan types now offered to affluent buyers, as their wealth makes them considerably less risky to lenders, this may continue to help ignite sales again. Mansion Global just announced that both New York and San Francisco saw their numbers of sales increase during February. However, both markets report that there has been a trade-off in so much as asking prices were negotiated downwards by as much as 17% in San Francisco and 12% in New York. Although of equal note, both these markets did see their price points reach unprecedented heights at the end of 2021. So leveling out was not unexpected. On the other hand, as we reported last month, markets that still offer more affordability or potential price growth are expected to see an uptick in demand. The growth of demand for the luxury sector in these markets is heavily driven by millennials, particularly those who can work from home. According to Bloomberg, this generation is not living in their parents' basements anymore. They are buying multi-million dollar homes. Equally, Bloomberg expects his generation to change the high-end housing market as their preferences are driven by technology and environmental requirements. 
Expectations are that we will see many fluctuations in demand, prices, and sales over the next few months. There will be a lack of consistency between markets and within markets themselves, where certain price points will see high demand and others very little interest. Specific property types, as well as locations, are very much back on the table when it comes to buyer preferences too. Location has always been important to the affluent, and there is very little expectation for this to change, except perhaps in the diversity of new locations that will come to the forefront of demand this year. Old favorites such as key metropolises will continue to attract those whose business lies within, but it is the increasing demand for multiple ownership of properties in rural, waterfront and mountain locations, especially those that are less affected by climate change, that are expected to see the most growth. Demand for very specific property types will also bring change to the luxury market, as the wealthy not only seek the right location, but also homes with amenities that equally meet their practical needs and must-have requirements. Expect to see growth in the multi-generational home. New builds are being designed to cater to extended families. Whether it's multiple master suites, separate living spaces, or even additional homes on the property. That is not to say the trend is all about bigger. As people recognize they are happy to return to smaller footprints, particularly those heading toward metropolitan lifestyles, health and wellness are still top of mind. Instead, it is the use of space to promote physical and mental well-being that has become appreciated in an entirely new way. While the obvious, such as access to amenities like gyms, yoga studios, and spas is important, it is the demand for sustainability and smart homes that is truly on the rise. Luxury homes, apartment buildings, and townhouse complexes are turning towards sustainable living options. This is not just for new builds, as many properties have gone through extensive renovations to provide for this demand. Using smart home technology has helped to facilitate changing these environments with fully automated systems that control not just entertainment and security systems, but lighting, temperature, air quality, and water conservation. One trend that was on the uptick prior to the arrival of the pandemic was the demand for hotel-style living in private residences. And according to Mansion Global, we should expect to see the demand for branded residences return. They predict that these residences will dominate the high-end home market as the affluent seek not just the best white glove service, but also the opportunity to enjoy experiences, and they're willing to pay top dollar. Privacy and security also remain highly important to the affluent, and there has been a notable increase in advanced security systems being implemented as well as demand for properties that offer privacy and seclusion, whether branded residents or private homesteads. If you're looking to buy or sell luxury real estate, it's important to approach the market with a critical and analytical mindset. By understanding the current market realities and setting realistic expectations, we can ensure that you reach your goals. At Mansion Arizona, we're here to help you navigate the luxury real estate market in Arizona. We offer free consultations to help you explore your options and determine the best course of action for you. Plus, if you have any questions about living the luxury lifestyle in Arizona, we're more than happy to provide you with all the information you need. Contact us today to get started.